Hey, in this video, I'm going to show you how to test the WP Give plugin for WordPress. All right, let's get started. Okay, so there's lots of reasons you'd obviously want to test your plugin. One, just to make sure your settings are all configured correctly, to make sure you're getting the email confirmations, uh, to, to make sure it works. So right now, what we're going to do is we're going to log into WordPress. We're going to go into our dashboard, and we're going to set up a test. Okay, so here we are. I just logged into WordPress. And this is your main dashboard. If you go down here to donations, this is the give WP donations. Um, and we're going to go on to settings. Great. This is the WP give settings page. And we're going to just go to payment gateways. And once you're here, you're simply just going to enable the test mode by clicking this little radio button there. That's going to turn the test mode, or what's known as the sandbox, for your payment gateway. It's going to turn that on. So obviously, at this point, you should have your payment gateway already connected. That could be Stripe. It could be Square. It could be PayPal. It could, it could be a whole, a whole bunch of different payment gateways. All right, with test mode enabled, all you want to do is go down and save the settings. So what this does is it triggers the test mode for your payment gateway. So that will automatically turn on your Stripe or your Square or PayPal's sandbox so that you can do a test donation. Now, simply just go to your donation page. And you're going to see here, you should have a notification that says test mode is enabled. Go ahead and fill out your form. And when you get down to the card information, depending on the gateway that you're using, it's going to depend on the card number that you're, you'll be entering. Now, Stripe uses the card number 42424242424242. And then at which point any month and year that's in the future and any CV code. Now, keep in mind, every payment gateway may have a different credit card that you need to enter. I think um, Squares is like 4111111111111. Do go ahead and complete your form and make sure you use the correct credit card for the test and then go ahead and hit donate. Once your test donation has been processed, you'll be sent to a thank you page that you've probably already set up. Um, and in which case, your test is complete. You want to go ahead then and check your donations panel inside your WordPress website. Um, so I have that tab open here already. To see the test donation, you simply just go into your dashboard under donations, click the button called donations, and you will see a list of all your current donations, including the one you just did, the test donation, and it'll be clearly marked test, just like that. Now, you may also want to go ahead and check your email inbox to make sure that the auto reply email was sent, the confirmation emails were sent, um, and all the other stuff that should be triggered when you do a donation. But that is how you test it. Now, of course, if you have any errors that show up, you're going to want to troubleshoot that. The GiveWP support uh, is very good at responding relatively quickly to help you troubleshoot any errors that you may have. Once you're done, though, and you've tested it, and the test has been sent and completed, make sure you go back and turn the test off. So simply go back into your WP settings under test mode and disable that and save that. Once you've disabled the test mode, your site is now again taking live donations and your test is complete. Well, great folks, I hope that's helped you. And if you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments below. And if you like this video, make sure you give a thumbs up and please subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.